there can be a huge big mess <laughs> that can form out of nothing just from not communicating, communicating improperly, not being empathetic when you are communicating with someone who either is struggling, having a dif difficult time. And I think it's really underestimated a lot. Again, the goal is to try to find a solution to the problem so that everybody can work together. When everybody's working together on the same page, that increases the bottom line for the company. The company is going to be more productive. They're going to be more valuable. They're going to, whatever defines success for the company, you're going to be able to reach that. I think that there was a, um, there was a statistic put out by Gallup, one of Gallup surveys, and they said the cost of turnover and the cost to replace one employee, I think was like 1.5 times the employee's annual salary or something so outrageous because there was a decrease in productivity and a decrease in morale and a time where, um, you know, you would have to train the next person. And so I have found it's so much better just to communicate, make sure everyone's on the same page, try to retain those employees that, um, you know, what, whatever the behavior is can potentially be corrected. Um, and, and then hopefully it will end up limiting legal liability in the long run. A lot of times when, um, you know, I litigated for 15 years. And so a lot of times we would find out why the employee sued the company and they would say, I didn't know what I was doing wrong. They never told me that I was messing up or um, I didn't like the way that this person was speaking to me. And so it just goes to show you that um, communication, discussing expectations, everyone to, to be on the same page and, and know what their responsibilities are going forward, I think does play a really, really, really big role. I could not agree more. I think the onus is on the leaders, the founders to have the hard conversations. That's your responsibility for the business, for the team. You're all working together. Right. Exactly. And a lot of times it comes from the top down. I, I think if you have a team of of managers, you know, they have to be on board and, and they have to be presenting the company in a good light too. But from the top down also, a lot of people are going to follow the the top, the leadership from the top and and follow their lead as well. So 